What's up everybody? Welcome back to Car Studio. I'm your host Yusuf and this is my 1987 BMW 325iS and I'm making this video today because the first video about the eBay Turbo Review got a lot of positive feedback and there was a lot of people interested in the drivability of the car and how it performs, what it sounded like, how it idled. So now that we got air in the tire and the battery jump started, uh, let's hop in it and uh, give it some beans. that I wanted to address was about the oil filter uh, location so when you turbo a car the manifolds uh, where they come down they generally don't clear the oil filter um, in the factory location and the, the main reason is because of these oil cooler lines they stick out very far you can see right now they're almost touching my manifold so from a factory your oil filter is uh, perpendicular with the ground it's just you know straight up and down so what I did was I found out if you know obviously you loosen that um, it's either a 17 or a 19 millimeter bolt uh, right there that holds the oil filter um, adapter plate loosen that and you'll have to take off your oil cooler lines too and then you can clock the oil filter adapter um, to about a 45 degree you can just barely see sorry the lighting's not that great you can barely see the oil filter right there. It's at about a 45 degree angle facing the front of the car. And doing that gets the oil filter up out of the way. It rotates the adapter to where the cooler lines are uh, further away from the manifold. And I had to bend mine just slightly a little bit, but you know, every car is different. You may not even have to bend yours, but 
yep that's how it's done and so that's it for this video guys thank you so much for joining me today and i hope i answered all of your questions from the first part if you missed that video it was the ebay turbo review part one um it's going to be at the end of this video I, I didn't even plan on making a part two but there were a lot of questions that were left unanswered and i thought i could make this video and give you guys a full experience inside the car and outside the car but um yeah, like this video, comment if you have any questions, subscribe to the channel. Every Monday and Thursday there's new content. And uh, enjoy this next clip where I went down one-way street the wrong way. So here we are inside the car. 